Hello, Eagles Nation. This is your boy, the Almighty Green Talents, once again doing another video for the Philadelphia Eagles. Um, intercepting a pass thrown by the quarterback um, for, for the first six points, with the kicker kicking the extra field goal, giving the extra, extra points, giving us seven points for the score. Well, let's just say what I witnessed in the um. Second half of this game, we got to compare it to what I've seen in the first half. First half was legit. Um, Hurts threw for 60 yards, one touchdown score, which was thrown to um, that it got it with 10 yards out. And he printed that ball into the end zone for the, for, for, for the, for the score. And we scored actually 14 points. I think the, I think, I think the other score was on, was on a run play. So that's your two scores right there. 14 points with Jake Elliott making the extra field goal for both um score, making it 14 points. But in this second half, wow. Um nothing much I really can say about that. Um because the second and third stringers was in the first was it was in the second half of the game, third and fourth quarter. Um the Eagles tried to bet the battle back. Which, which it was, we had the score, which was 14 to 10, but they let the Giants, they, they let the New York just come back and score another touchdown, which put them up 17 to 14 over us. And then, uh, we wind up, um, throwing the ball into the end zone. Well, not, not into the end zone. We actually threw the ball where actually didn't got, um, Senate is his name. He's he the third string quarterback. He went up tossing the ball to, I think, a, to a tight end or running back, whatever it was. And he was like five yards out. And they ran into, he, and he, he sprinted into the end zone for the um, score, which made it um, 21, I think. What was it? 2014. Yeah, 21. 21 to. Um, uh, um, twenty-one to seventeen at the time. Like I said, it was seventeen to fourteen. But when they, when when we scored, it wound up being twenty-one to seventeen. We had to lead up by four points, and so um, and the Eagles let the Giants. I mean, the Eagles let the Eagles third string defense let the New York Jets come back on three plays, two long balls, um, for first down plays, um. This is what you get when you get third string. When you get third stringers, your third stringers don't perform to the to the expectations of the, of the first and second stringers. So I'm not exactly sure what was going on, but you gotta look at it this way: um, team don't reveal much on offense and defense and preseason game because they, 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 they don't want teams picking them off. You know what I'm saying? Or trying to detect what they're gonna do next. So mostly. The team, most of the game, most of the most of the plays that I seen so far in the second half were mostly vanilla offenses, vanilla defenses. So that's the reason why we lost this football game, uh, 24-21. So uh, we lost about three points. So I mean, you can't really say nothing bad about that because if you look at it this way, the Eagles came out the, came out of this game with not too many injuries. They only had one injury, one injury from what I've heard. I forgot who the guy was that got injured. But you got engine on offense. So um they, they mentioned that in the second half of the game that one of the guys got injured in the um I think the first half, I believe, and he didn't play none in, in the second half of, of this game. So you get so so you gotta look at it this way. I mean Mountain Dew, baby. One of the best drinks in the world. But anyway, so that's what it came down to. You know, you had the third string players, first string play, first and second string play in the first half. The second half was all third stringers. So these are guys who try to make the roster, you know what I'm saying? So, so I mean, it ain't nothing really bad about it. I mean, I didn't get a chance to watch the Well, I watched the game, but it was on live stream on Facebook. And, um, when it all says, when it all said boy and dumb, when, when you look, think about it, um, I enjoyed the game, you know, but when you playing vanilla defenses and vanilla offenses on both sides of the ball, cause New York Jet played on vanilla defense and vanilla offense as well. So, but the Eagles Jet made a, a lot of mental errors in the second half of this game. Um, incomplete balls, some balls thrown all over the place. 
it could have been, it could be some, some, it could be some interception in the game, but it wasn't. The only interception that 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 was, that was got was by um the linebacker the Eagles signed to a one year deal. I think it, I think it Kazir, Kazir. I think that's his name. I, I can't even pronounce that guy and that guy's name correct, but he the one that they got the pick in the first half of, of the game. So that is you know so so. So you know what? Yeah, you know that 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 that's exactly what it is. They got an interception, but both points were scored on offense. So I mean, uh, I I'm not I'm not. I mean, don't get me wrong. A loss, a loss, and it just comes to a point where you got to realize that it's, it's preseason game. It ain't regular season. Like I said, I was watching the live stream on Facebook, and this young lady had the stream up on Facebook and so she was veering from her television. She didn't use no live stream so she actually she actually put the camera in front of her front of her T V for everybody who wants to watch the game. And since it wasn't broadcast in Tennessee, I had no choice but to watch it from that um uh, from that perspective. So I mean um I was glad to see the game on Facebook, but I would prefer to watch it live on TV. But at this point in time I got this um this cube this um uh, fire stick cube that been out for quite some time. It it works, but it doesn't catch channels right now because when we moved from our old location to the to the, to the new lo- to the new location, the old Wi-Fi signal is no longer on. It's no longer here. See, 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 it's a new Wi-Fi server that we under. This is an AT&T Wi-Fi server, so it's not connected well to that um to that Fire Stick Cube. So that's why I'm can't watch no games live here, live here. But to watch it on Facebook for some more to view it, I enjoyed it. You know what I'm saying? But uh, but like I said, let me, let me get back to the game. Um, like I said, a, a, a lot of mental errors. Um, like I mentioned. In the mid part of the video, it could be some interception thrown in this ball. Then guy, uh, Signet, I mean, he's the third string quarterback. He didn't do, he didn't do good and he didn't do great. You know what I'm saying? And so, um, he didn't throw any touchdown passes. He only threw, well, yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, he did. I'm sorry. Yeah, he did throw one touchdown pass, but he could have, he could have had some interception in the game too because he had, he, he threw some un, Necessary balls in the air that could have been picked off. Luckily, they luckily they luckily they, they went through their hands or got battered down by our offensive players on the field. So that prevented the intercept. So, so overall, there were no interception on the um the first half of the game. No ints. Second half of the game, no int. But it should have been some int in the second half because there was, like I said, there were too many Aaron ill advised Aaron balls thrown in the air, and so. That's what I have an issue with is the errors in the second half of the game. The defense didn't do well because when you get your first compared to your first and second string defense and then you then your third string defense on the field, it's like it's like patchwork. So if you look at it this way, you know when you have whole big big old real big hole in your pan, and so you get so so you find a, a, a patch to patch the hold up. This is what the third string defense pretty much was like. They were like they were like a patchwork defense. They didn't know where to go. They didn't know who to block or I mean, I mean who to contain. Cause they allowed, like I said, in the second half of this game, they allowed two long balls that were thrown by the quarterback. So that gives you so that that should give you some idea right there of what I'm talking about when I said some some, some ball. On defense, that should that should have been stopped. So I mean, like I said, um, so Nick Sirianni, his offensive coaches, and um, and Rich and, 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 and Gannon, Jonathan Gannon, and his defensive coaches got a lot of work to do on defense and offense. They got a lot of work to do. They they, they got to figure out now who to cut because um, teams gonna start cutting players. I think after the second preseason game, so. So this, so the, so these third stream players now got one more chance to make a difference in the second game that's coming next week. Um, I'm not exactly sure what the game plans are going to be, but I do know it, it needs to be some change up because there were two way too many errands in the second half of this game. I mean, like I said, I watched the second, I watched the first half, I didn't see it, 
but I watched what I could, and I saw some very good plays made by the first and second string offense and defensive players in the first half. Second half, straight, straight, <laughs> straight, straight, third string players, and they play like garbage. I mean, everybody, I'm putting it this way, every Eagle content creator ain't going to have their own opinion about what they've seen and what they witnessed in the first and first quarter, in the first half, and the second half of the game. I can't wait to see what they all got to say. You know what I'm saying? Some some gonna be screaming from some gonna be blowing the heads off their off top of their heads. Some gonna have some good things to say, some bad things to say, some things need to be corrected. And I only thing I can say what we need to be corrected is really the, the patchwork third string defense. They need to be looked at. And so so um overall Let's watching the game on, on 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 Facebook. It was good to see it, good to enjoy it. But overall, it was just terrible second second half, terrible second half. So, um, so to all my Eagles content creators out there, hope you guys out there enjoying the game. I hope you watched it. I can't I can't wait to see what you all got to say about this game. And so overall, you can do four things for me. You can comment, like, share, subscribe. And comment in the comment section below and let me know what you think about this video. Uh, I hope you watched the first video that I made an hour and a half ago. I'm going off two hours now prior to this um, preseason game that, that I witnessed and what I saw. So comment there and then comment here as well. Because this one I'm, I'm putting up later. So uh, this is your boy, the Almighty Green Talent, coming at you guys with this video. And most importantly, um... Y'all enjoy the rest of y'all Friday night because next week's game, I'm not exactly who, who, who we play next week, but I can't wait to watch that game as well. It more like going to be on Facebook again because a lot of these games could be televised, some won't be televised, so I'm just going to try to enjoy the best way I can. So you guys enjoy y'all Friday night. See you guys next week. Once again, the Almighty Green Tyler intercepting the pass thrown by the quarterback. Run to the end zone for the touchdown, which is six points, with the kicker kicking the extra field goal to make it seven points for the win. Holler back. Peace out.